it's Jessica and today I have a video that's a little bit different from what I normally do. I'm going to be doing a story time video. I asked you guys what type of like sit down, like more kind of like chill video you guys wanted to see and you guys said you wanted me to do a story time video so that's what I'm doing. So this is basically just me going to be telling you guys a story of something that happened to me. I'm going to be telling you guys about the time that I almost met Taylor Swift and got Loft 89. Okay, so let's just go ahead and get on into the story. Okay, so I went to see Taylor twice on the 1989 world tour, once in July in Chicago and then again in Indianapolis in September. We recreated the How You Get the Girl costumes. We got a pink crop top and skirt and then sewed pink lights all over them and they were the coolest things ever. Like I was kind of in love with them. We just got to like light up and it was amazing. So I went to the concert in July and it was like the best experience ever. It was so cool. I love stadium shows, especially with the light up bracelets. They just like everyone had one and like the whole crowd just lit up and it was so cool. And then I had to wait until September to go see her again and I was so excited. So then flash forward to the day of the concert. We got out of school early and then we got ready for the concert and then left. We got there like probably 10-ish minutes before the doors open and we stood in line and then once we got in we ran to Taylor Nation and by the time we got up there she literally like let us in like put the thing on for the pictures and like walked away and like so we didn't get to talk to anyone at Taylor Nation nor did anyone like take pictures of us for outfits or anything so it was kind of sad because we waited in line for so long and the picture didn't even turn out that good so it was kind of a ton of waste of time and we missed Vance Joy which was like really depressing but we were in line for Taylor Nation we did have a couple people like take pictures of our outfits or like come up and say that they loved our outfits which was super cool and then we started walking around to go look at the other booths and to get something to eat because it was starving and there were a lot of people that just kind of like turned their heads and like looked at us and were like whoa you guys are like lighting up that's pretty cool so then we went in and watched Vance Joy perform his last songs. When we got to our seats, I started freaking out because they were so, so close. Like, I had had these same seats before to see her on the Red Tour, but I honestly just forgot how good they were because I had just gone to Chicago and didn't have, like, the best seats for that. So I literally got there and was like, oh my god. I started freaking out and, like, I was just so excited. So we were waiting for Taylor. It was about 30 minutes between Vance and her, so we were just sitting there, talking to my friend, eating... And then Andrea, who's Taylor's mom, starts like, I see her come out from behind the stage. So I run down there and she's taking with some pictures on the floor, but I can't go on the floor because you can't go on the floor unless you have a floor seat. So I like yelled at her and waved and then she smiled and waved back at me and it was great. I started freaking out. I was like, ah, Taylor's mom just waved at me. What even? It was so cool. So then I freaked out for a little bit and we waited for Taylor to come on. Feel So Close played and I danced my heart out, the lights dimmed, the lights behind the stage came on, and the music for Welcome to New York started playing, and the curtain rose, and the dancers started walking out, and then Taylor comes and is like, Welcome to New York. We were jamming out the whole time, and honestly, I wasn't really thinking about Loft 89 that much. I mean, obviously, I think it would have been really cool to get chosen for it, but it wasn't, like, what I was thinking about. I was just focusing on, like, having a fun time and dancing. And So after I Wish You Would, there's a clip of her friends talking about her before she comes out for How You Get the Girl, so she has time to change. So I see one of the, like, security people talking to Mom Swift, and I was like, oh my gosh, she's right there again. Like, I want to go say hi and get a picture with her but I couldn't again because she was on the floor but then I see the security guard like point right at us and I was like oh my god I was like tr like freaking out because I'm like she's like pointing at us and like our light up outfits and then mama was like looking at us and I was like oh my god are we gonna get loft are we gonna meet Taylor and I started like freaking out I was just kind of like okay Jessica you're gonna stay calm you're gonna be fine it's okay and I was like is this actually really about to happen so she starts walking up towards us and I was like oh my god okay calm down Jessica don't freak out and then she looked at us for a second but we weren't like right on the end there were like two people and then she like looks at us for a second and then she walks up and chooses people two rows behind us and I was just like 
Are you freaking kidding me? Because the lady, it was really obvious that she was pointing to us, not them. Even my dad, who was like, saw it too. He was like, they were definitely pointing at you. Also think that she might have not wanted to like climb over the two people to talk to us because we weren't like on the end. It would have been a little bit harder to get to, but still. So I was kind of sad because that would have been so cool to meet Taylor. But I just was kind of like... <laughs> seriously so then after that happened I knew that like we weren't gonna get loft the rest of the night because we kind of already like missed our chance and it wasn't gonna happen so I just had fun at the rest of the concert and it was still so much fun not being able to meet her didn't like deter from the amazing night or anything before Taylor sang love story the rotating the catwalk like lifts up in the air and like turns into like the B stage and just kind of like turns around and she like goes around to see everybody and she was like right above us right before she sang love story so she walked over and she was like oh yeah look at all these people in this section you guys are pretty dressed up um people just wrap themselves in christmas lights there's a giant swan sign over there and um we were the people that wrapped ourselves in christmas lights so that was us and she literally saw us and started talking about our outfits and i started crying so hard. My friend actually has pictures of me on her phone just like full out sobbing. By the way, thanks a lot for that Izzy. I really appreciate that and you showing it to everybody. That was honestly really, really cool. And then I had a letter that I had brought to the concert to give to Taylor if I somehow ran into somebody that could give it to her. So I saw these people get chosen for loft on the floor, so I went down and found them after the concert and gave them the letter and asked them if they could give it to Taylor and they said sure. And then I found them on Instagram after the concert and asked if they gave it to her and they said yeah, that she really appreciated it and I was like, ah! So Taylor talked about her outfits and she got her letter, so it was basically an amazing night, and she also had the band Perry come out and sing, and it was just really, really fun. Probably the best concert I've ever been to. I screamed and cried and was so happy. Okay, so that is it for this story time video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did enjoy it, it would be awesome if you'd give this video a thumbs up for me. And if you'd like to see more videos from me in the future, then you should subscribe to my channel. The link is down there. I post videos every single weekend. If you'd like me to do more like story time videos in the future, let me know in the comments and like what types of stuff you would like me to do them on. And I will definitely do that if you guys enjoy this. So I think that's about it. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in another video next weekend. Bye!